Hey folks, another Friday and I'm back. As we discussed, this is gonna be my third video. Uh, my first video was about two most important factors in SEO in 2018. Then we discussed about top trends in digital marketing, wherein my first trend was mobile marketing. And today, we'll talk about video marketing in detail. So what exactly is video marketing? Why videos are, you know, boosting like anything? Any platform you check out, Facebook, Instagram, what actually you see? I see videos, videos, videos. So what exactly is the methodology and what are the difference? You know, what are the different trends in videos that are coming up and uh, to explore all the uh, platforms let's say Facebook YouTube LinkedIn Twitter that is you know it has a own different methodology like how that video should be and you know it should address the right audience so what are the things that we need to keep in picture while we are making a video so that's what we are going to discuss today see what I'm doing right now I'm talking to you on video right so what does that mean we are all on board we all believe that video is good so got lot to discuss dive in Alright, let's start. Video, the fastest growing online marketing medium. Today, we are going to discuss about different platforms and you know the usage, the proper distribution of video, whatever we are making. You know, we need to make sure that our videos are reaching the right audiences. First, we need to understand there are no verticals or there is no organization size. You know, videos are for anyone. It doesn't matter if you are an organization of 10 people. You know, some people think that if my organization is, let's say, of 10,000 people or something like that, you know, videos will be a good opportunity but that's not true videos are for everyone depending what business we have we need to select what type of video we should produce so basically I'll talk about uh, four platforms today Facebook Instagram Twitter and LinkedIn all of them are different in you know some ways let's say story feature this feature is only provided by Instagram the story feature of Instagram and Instagram has the ability to do the videos for just one minute wherein Facebook you can go for longer videos the duration might be up to 45 minutes when LinkedIn comes into picture there are again longer videos let's say up to 10 minutes YouTube there is no parameter you can go for hours you know that depends on you so there are differences in the platform when we you know make videos so we need to understand what kind of video we need to make you know is it right for our business or not so first we'll discuss the top three video trends that are going up my first trend would be going live this particular feature going live is being I believe it is on almost all the platforms which I said going live feature is there on Instagram it is there on Facebook it is there on YouTube which is a great source I would say because going live has its own advantages so that's the reason it is coming as the first trend in video marketing second would be 360 degree and virtual reality which is going on these days 360 degrees are beautiful depending how we create it and what exactly is the reason behind that you know our business and the third trend which is coming up are animated videos a great way to explain complicated things in a simple manner so these are the top three trends and now we'll discuss about some more trends you know which are coming up and which are easier you know which are easy to explore and get a great benefit out of it one would be taking live webinars this is one of the best technique that I have seen you know over a couple of time because going webinars can be scheduled you know for anyone anywhere in the world with different time zones webinar will give you the advantage because I believe if you are taking a webinar let's say of 100 people those 100 people have invested in you let's say the webinar goes for 45 minutes or one hour that means they are listening to you for one hour they are understanding your product what exactly you want to say your services you are explaining it to them that to life you know so basically once your webinar get over gets over I believe there are a lot of businesses wherein there is hardcore cold calling involved when you might be calling thousand people and you might you know struggle to get one qualified leads wherein in webinars as, as I already said they are investing you know one hour of the day for you that means once the webinar is over we'll be getting the email addresses of all those people who have attended that so this will be a smarter technique I believe the call even if we make a call it's gonna be a warm call because you have already explained everything to the right audience that what actually your product is and how it is going to help them so this will make a lot of difference here second thing what I want to speak about is the most trending thing in YouTube if you notice is unboxing videos a great strategy why I'll say you something let's say I've ordered a product right now and I have read a review when I was ordering it it was saying that this was awesome product I have received it on time and everything like that doesn't sound that good 
instead of that if i'm putting a unboxing video that is going to connect with me you know because he is a user i understand why he what he thought what he might have thought before making the decision of buying that once he has shown you the unboxing video how he has received it what is the kind of experience what are his thoughts about it that will help me to take a qualified decision and i might you know buy the best product by looking at people's unboxing videos i mean understanding what exactly this product is and how it is going to make a difference out there with other products that are available so unboxing is a great great strategy that is coming up to coming into picture there are a lot of small small things that we need to understand for example if you are adding captions in your video that is going to engage users you know that will engage the engagement of the engagement of the video you know users getting engaged to your video will be more if you are using captions so that's a, just a small thing which you keep in your video that will give you a plus point again so basically video marketing you know uh, everyone to be honest wants to be you know if they can afford everyone wants to go on television and promote their brand because they know that they will it will reach some sort of audiences they might get calls they might get sale calls or they might get business from it but to be very honest the budget will be so big if you are trying to do it on you know on video on tvs but the same thing on a minimized budget can be done just by what i'm doing right now by creating a video you know making it reaching to my right audiences and explaining them what exactly is it about and this particular thing is totally trackable measurable whereas the other thing which i said on the television if i do i won't be able to track it 100% but here i'll be aware of my spend i'll be aware of my reach i'll be aware of my leads how much i'm getting so it is a great you know source again here now as i said the basic easy strategy would be creating one long video for a product let's say for 10 minutes when i'm uploading this video on facebook i have no challenges because the length can go up to 45 minutes it might be more but that is the ideal length that has been suggested so my video is there now i need to think about instagram because it is allowing me it is giving me a special feature a story feature and just a 1 minute video so either i can do one thing i can make a video and then i can cut it into parts and i can provide it to the right platform in the right way. Way. let's say the 10 minute video which i made i can take the best one minute and upload it in instagram snapchat if you talk about it is a you know it is a very good platform again it has some of the features which others does so this is the thing you need to understand the platform how it's going to work talking about linkedin linkedin is all about business 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 people are going to listen you know if you are uploading a video on linkedin it if even if it is 10 minutes long doesn't matter because the audience there is there to listen and according to my statistics and all the statistics that we seen and according to my knowledge i believe videos connects users in a better way rather than text because if i have a text let's say of 2000 words long and i want to reach you know more number of audiences it will be a problem for me or a challenge for me you know in reaching out more number of people if i am pro producing a content of 2000 words if i am making a video out of that content explaining all the things what i have explained in my content i am you know i'm 10000 percent sure that my videos will be watched by billions and billions of people you know at so this is the thing obviously blogs if you talk about blogs blogs are trending but if you have seen most of the blogs will have images they have video because if you do that engagement rate increases you know there is a higher amount of chances of you know if if they watch your video they like it they probably might subscribe it they probably might you know try to reach you by email or by any other sources which you are giving so video definitely is one of the best ways you know if i don't want to talk about stats you can check any stats online it will be it will be saying that uh, by 2020 80% of the companies will be focusing on video marketing everyone is going to focus on video marketing that is the reason why they are doing it because it is so in terms of cost i would say it is one of the cheapest you know sources of reaching the audiences seo or paid ads everything you know will be a little more challenging rather than you know video because video is a great source to reach out the audience you know the way you want to the way you want to connect with them as i said going live going live is a very good feature it has got a q and a i mean if you are a subject matter expert let's say then let's challenge your audience no let's challenge your target audience let them ask what they want to answer the question they'll understand what exactly you know you are capable of and you definitely they'll reach out to you so it's a great great source so this is all about video marketing and apart from that 
uh, the top things which we need to take care for video I said top three trends which are going up need to make sure we are going live for our businesses if it is required to just think of a case if I have opened a restaurant or a bar you know if I'm writing article about it telling um, showing photos about it that house my food house the ambience house everything if you do the same thing go live there show the audiences what exactly it is how's the ambience how's the food how's everything just a two minute video will give you so much amount of traffic which can which a blog or any any related any such post cannot so you need to understand i mean we need to understand here that video marketing is going to be the trend and it is the it is going to boost like anything so that's all about video marketing i want to share if you have any thoughts about video marketing which i haven't shared i would love to hear back from you you can comment down you can like subscribe my video if you like please do share your outcomes in basis of you know in terms of video marketing if anything you are doing different what i said thank you so much